Okay, right now we're, ex we're exploring a different new, it's a new medium, it's been around for a few years. It's a, actually a large inkjet printer which will uh, take any image either on a flash drive or in, uh, in a computer, computer's memory banks that will uh, take an image and then actually inkjet it right onto a fabric, which used to be impossible to do, but in, that was the realm of only oil paintings and acrylic paintings would, would be able to go onto a fabric like this. Now this does not need, this is a print, but does not need glass. That's the beautiful thing about this whole process. But we do go through, a, um, the process goes like this. We basically put it on a stretcher bars, we create a frame that goes in behind and we staple it in behind so that it actually will fold around the corners, pretty much like you would imagine doing any oil painting, it's the same idea. And this uh, will then, you have a couple options. You can either leave it like that, put a little black tape on there and that's which is quite a popular thing to do now. It just hangs on the wall like it is. Uh, or you can then get really interested and put a, uh, a beautiful frame around it just like, like this, or with a liner. And it goes in, it's hard to show right now, but that's how it'll go. Or you do a, a, a little insert like this, which is an enhancer, and that creates a little bit more of an interest as well. Or you add a very traditional li a linen liner like this. This is something that has been around for centuries. It creates a little bit of a, a separation between, it's sort of like the matting idea, it creates an in, a, a separation between your frame and your artwork. And in some cases that's, uh, that's a, an appropriate thing to do. And you end up with that.